Hello guys, good morning. So uh, my name is Amit and uh, today we will be discussing about the theoretical topics of Python that uh, we can use in networking for implementing some automation. So theory can be boring but uh, we have to see this as a building blocks of Python. Examples like uh, uh, when we learn about uh, TCP IP it was quite boring and complex and perhaps frustrating at some times. So uh, example, uh, if we don't know the OSI, it will be difficult for us to troubleshoot the network issues. It's not exciting to read uh, about, uh, it was not exciting to read about TCP, IP, OSI and uh, IP subnetting, but we need to learn these things and we have learned these things as a building block of uh, networking. Uh, same way Python basics uh, are the building blocks of future scripts that we will use in automation. Uh, when, you, uh, when you look at the Python code, it may seem strange and so learning Python is like a learning new language, new language, so uh, a new way of doing things. So the question is, uh, what is Python? Uh, Python is a programming language that is, uh, Python is an object oriented language and it was created by Gudo van Rusum in 1991. So Python is used for uh, web development, software development, uh, mathematics and uh, also system scripting that uh, we, will, we, will, uh, we will be going to use in uh, networking. Like I said, Python is, a, is an object oriented language and uh, uh, everything, is, uh, everything in Python is an object like whatever input we are providing to any function is an object. So Python has various function types like uh, we have a boolean, a boolean object, we have a comparisons, numeric type, sequence type, we have set type and we have a mapping type. You can go to the uh, Python website and you can see the documentation, the built-in data types, we have uh, a truth value, we have the comparison like uh, less than, equal to, uh, less than equal to not equal to is is not we have the number type like integer float complex numbers and uh, We have the bitwise operation. So we will be discussing like some of the data types that are important for uh, Network scripting So we have uh, two types of objects we have uh, mutable objects and immutable objects so mutable objects are like uh, if the data value assigned to an object can be changed it's these are the mutable object like uh, we have a list dictionary byte array and user defined classes what are immutable uh, if a data value assigned to an object can't be changed so these are the immutable objects like we have integer string float complex boolean tuple range frozen set bytes so let's see it in the interpreter so I have uh, two Ubuntu servers, so I will use one for the version 2.7 and one for version 3. So let's uh, start it and just wait for the server to boot up. So it has came up. Okay. So we got the IP address. Thank you guys for watching the video. If it was uh, informative to you, please like it, subscribe it, and uh, hit the bell icon for upcoming notifications. Uh, stay home, stay safe, and help stop coronavirus. Uh, see you in the next video where we will see Python interpreter and discover the syntax in Python 2.7 and 3.6. We will also see what, uh, what are variables and how we can use variable to store value or let's say if we want to store any IP address or the interface list in a variable. Thank you.